things. Uh, so Jay actually wanted to bring you another review of another diaper bag, and this is the Highline Skip Hop. This is the crossbody or cross something uh, bag. It's a beautiful bag. I got this one for, for my birthday, a new bag that came out a couple months ago, I want to say. I don't know exactly when it came out, but um, but definitely I saw first the other version of this one, which is a tote, and I really like the colors. Uh, it was a little bit overpriced, so not really on my comfortable level because I didn't know anything over the bag until they came out with this one. Now, this one, because I can wear it three ways, um, I thought, well, that's worth the money and as well all the details. And when I received it, I instantly fell in love with First things I want to address address is basically uh, the design on the back so it, all the all the these details or all the if these are leather uh, the hand the hand this one are leather you can um, put them either you can put them down or if not you can use it like this as well so if you need to carry it whatever you need to carry it you have that's a pretty good thing to have all the time. Um, as well on the side, it has the Skip Hop logo right here. So that is also leather and all of the base of the attachments are leather. Um, the bag is 100% cotton, so it's actually stain free uh, or stain resistant cotton, so which that's pretty amazing. Um, I haven't had any spills on my bag or anything, but yesterday that I used it the entire day, it didn't actually got stained. It looks perfect. Um, yeah, no, it didn't got stained. So yeah, so here you have basically the bag. I have it half packed because I took out some stuff, uh, but it's, this is mainly how I actually took it yesterday. Um, but just imagine having obviously here. So in this pocket, on the front pocket that I have in here, I put my cell phone, I just have it right here, but basically it's an iPhone Plus, so you can reach it easily, um, and you can put a lot of stuff there, like your keys or um, anything that is like slippable, because it's not really anything you can slip on, or in, I'm sorry, slip in, it's perfect, because the problem is that these ones are not magnetized, and they really don't give a lot, so you really have to just keep it like that. Now um, I have a pacipod and here I just keep my, my pacifiers. Um, also on the sides you have the bottle pockets which the bottle pockets are right here. Um, I just have my mam bottle here. So this is like the other skip up except the, the zipper is actually kind of like on the side. So both they has two bottle pockets in each side so one and two. And then, um, as well on the sides, you have the stroller strap that you can actually remove, detach both of them, like the two sides, and just take this out. But I think it looks very cute with it, so I just keep it like that. Um, on the back part, you have where the changing pad goes. I don't have it with me, but it's a, actually a very cushiony um, changing pad. To access your front pocket, you can either just leave it like this, or you can definitely just, it's a magnetized pocket. So it's pretty easy to access. Now, the go, it goes all the way to, like if it was the deluxe one, so it has kind of like the same length. Um, as well here, I just keep like some, these uh, medical records and some coupons, so nothing really important in here. Um, well, the medical records are, but not the rest. So, and then you open this, or you can just keep it like that, but when you carry as a, as a backpack, this is gonna give it. So you have to definitely close it. Well, I'll recommend that basically. So, so when you open the bag in the middle, so you have basically here. This is how I have it packed right now. That doesn't even look that I have it. But I don't know if you can see that inside. You can only see the pouch there. But I have just a few things. Um, I still have a lot of space. If I needed it to make it bigger, then I just expand the straps right here and then it's like a very boxy backpack so it will look like this and there is where you can actually put a lot of stuff and this one opens all the way to the side so it basically you can open it as wide as this it is pretty nice um, 
you're gonna say you have a lot of pockets so you have a pocket which is all the weight on the front so here you can put maybe some changing change of clothes maybe some bags maybe some snacks and then it has four um it's they're not mesh pockets but they're actually uh it has uh, elastic and they're quite big i mean they're pretty big more than stand for like bottles or whatever they're big so you have four of those ones so in the middle just to give you an idea i have my big quick uh from jujubee this is in the black magic um onyx collection and what i have in here is basically a diaper kit uh so i have i always carry with me three diapers three to four i just have one right now because i used two yesterday um, I have some uh, wet ones, uh, Honest Company wipes, and then uh, some sample wipes. And as well, I have the changing pad that came on the, my Petunia Pickle Bottom. I use this one because it's a little bit like just easier to keep. And then I also uh, have a change of clothes over here just in case it gets messy or anything. Or Normally, it's because it's been like hot and I have my Catan. I take him out only in diapers. And then if I were, were in a store or anything and I feel that it's cold for him, then I put him wants you on and they just put it my good time so definitely this is i love bringing this because this one honestly just you know take it with you to the bathroom you don't have to take the entire diaper bag um, which i think sometimes is gross to actually put it like kind of like on there and then you cannot put it on the floor because the bathroom so anyway so i also have my oopsie i also have here my this is kind of like my my wallet, my mommy things. Um, I don't keep anything. I just have some Kleenex, my small little wallet, and then I just have a lipstick here from yesterday. That's about it. And then I also have I keep here um, just hand sanitizer uh, to wash my hands. If there's no uh, like you know if there's no washing or whatever, I cannot wash my hands so just keep that and as well I keep uh, some for the fever and cream just random stuff there I keep my sunglasses as well and I also keep my um, obviously the dispenser this is the juby one I'm not I don't like it that much it's too big and too thick but it's okay and then on one of the pouches I just I have my the Petunia Pickle Bottom, also they came with one of my, my Petunia Pickle Bottom, um, uh, my Petunia Pickle Bottom diaper bags. Um, this one right here, just keep another, this ones are already open, the ones that I have on the pack are not, but this ones I actually keep it because they're like double seal or something, but this one's, um, they leak, so I just tend to keep them here. And then on the side pockets, I just have a boogie wipe I have here one wipe that I have left so I just have it on hand with me and then I have uh, you know the draft uh, to take out any stains or anything and then uh, oh here I forgot I have here I went for my gift from Sephora anyhow this is how it looks empty so as you can see there's four four pockets in each room two pockets in each side um, it's, they're huge you can put a lot of stuff like just to give you an idea let me see because I haven't actually tried it I don't think no it's not gonna fit okay so for example this pouch which it will be like a medium pouch this one actually does fit in the pockets so just to give you an idea and I made it disappear So the pouch fits in there um so you can feed a lot of stuff i have in one of the pouches i forgot i have a more board feed right there i just have it folded there um also you have a zipper pocket which you can put a lot of stuff as well look how big this is and it goes deep so it has a bunch of pockets um where to put yourself pouches and a lot of stuff plus being such a beautiful bag like this um it's really awesome that you can carry it as a backpack, as a crossbody, or as a tote if you want. Um, so definitely, this is one of my favorite bags right now. It is on the heavy side. Uh, this bag retails for $199. Not being by heavy side, not meaning by the. It is expensive, but heavy side meaning that it's you know it's still it's right now it's 
kind of empty and you can still feel that you know it has a little bit of weight so um, if you're looking for a lightweight no definitely this is not if you're looking for a chic like full of pockets and beautiful and you know something that's gonna last you definitely I think this bag is gonna last me for a couple years so yeah um, if you have any questions or anything that you might want to ask or suggest please leave the comments down below and thanks for watching bye